CA Pay back at you with another video. In today's video, we're gonna go over the results of my KM Riker of the Week. Going through those results, y'all. Before we get started, hit that subscribe button. We are four people away from 2600. So if you see that subscribe button in red, please hit it so it won't be in red anymore and subscribe to this C8 Paint community. Let's get it. So this bike right here finished in second place. Hey, this bike finished in second place and it only lost by one vote. The voting was cut off today at 5 p.m. I let it go for an extra hour because these two bikes in particular were so close, but this bike got a ton of votes. You guys get showed this bike a ton of love, ton, ton, ton of love, ton of love, man. So this bike finished in second place by one vote. This is the closest Riker of the week that we've had since I started. This bike finished in last place, tied for last place actually. This camo, red, black, and white one, it finished tied for last place. You guys didn't like it or maybe you've seen too much of it but you didn't really vote for it. This bike finished in sixth place. Finished in sixth, sixth place, it did get some votes. Some of you guys liked it, some of you guys didn't. Yep, yep, sixth place it is. Thank you guys for voting, man. Nice bike, I like different, different is good, and this bike is definitely different, and I got a lot, a lot, a lot of comments about it. This bike finished in sixth place. My boy, Roro, Mr. 365 finished one vote out of third place but he finished in fourth place so i think when you do a little bit more i'm sure you're going to add some more additions to this thing and this thing is going to finish higher but in my opinion i really do like this new 2022 rally this is a nice looking bike row row so congratulations to you my guy real nice looking bike man and what we didn't capture was up here by the windshield he has some smaller speakers too so this is a nice looking bike, man. Good job, my guy, Roro. He finished in fourth place. Fourth place finish. This bike, my boy Ronald's bike, fan of Patrick Mahone, he finished in fifth place. He finished in fifth place. So, shout out to you, my guy. You finished in fifth place this week. Nice looking bike. I like it. The people liked it. Good job. Get in the comment section. Let me know what else you're going to add to this bike. I'm interested to know. I did see you say you're going to put an exhaust and you're working on some music. So shout out to that. This bike right here finished in first place this week by one vote. It beat bike number one by one vote. So shout out to Deadpool. Y'all know how it is, man. It's, this bike did well, man. People like this bike, man. They like Deadpool. They like this bike. This is our winner this week. Shout out to whoever put this wrap together. Good job. I got to check and see if Riker Raps did this wrap. Or who did it so i'm gonna check into that to let some of you guys know but yeah i i can i can agree with you guys uh this was also my vote this week and my guy um i did like my guy roro's bike so i liked his bike a lot too i like my boys ronald ronald's bike so you know again in my order of things probably would have been deadpool then i would have put ronald and my boy roro tied for like number two the black and orange one I don't know. I'm not, you know, the biggest orange fan, but I say it was like fourth place. So that's just me. We're entitled to our own opinions, right? Uh, this bike did pretty well too, but it did finish in seventh place. But it did get some votes. People did like it. They like the, you know, little subtleties of things and not all, you know, loud colors and splashy and so on and so forth. So shout out to this one. It finished in number seven. This one 
finished in last place. Nobody liked the leopard. Again, nobody liked the leopard. It finished in last place. This bike finished in third place. Third place. It got a lot of votes. It finished two votes back of the black and orange bike for second place. Oh, three votes back. This was the closest voting of the top three bikes in any of the weeks I had. Like, people were on the fence. This was a tough week. I like it when we have a tough week. Uh, people like to set up. Rockabye, baby. Rockabye. DJ Rockabye. Man, people like to set up. I see you. I see you. I see you. Yeah, yeah. In the back, those are 8.5s. In the front, these speakers, these are 6.5s. So get in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think about this week's voting. But Deadpool was definitely number one. Shout out to that number two bike, that black and orange bike. And shout out to bike number three, DJ Rockabye. And shout out to my boy, Roro, Mr. 365, fourth place. And Ronald with that Kansas City Chief bike, number five. Ronald, I'm telling you, I think if you got some music, you had a couple of little things to it, your bike going to be right up there. So you can resubmit when you change things up a little bit. Resubmit and see how we're doing. See how your bike stacks up. Remember, if you want to participate in Riker of the Week, all you have to do is send me a video or pictures to capay at gmail.com. I'll put everything together and get you in the next contest. You know we do the contest on Monday. We close the voting usually on Wednesdays at 4 or 5 o'clock, and I announce the winner. Shout out to this week's winners. And you know when you win, you usually get a T-shirt from me with the Riker on it and C.A. Pate. Until next time, my friends, C.A. Pate out.